Well, Jack is home, resting. I gave him some narcotic drugs that the doctor gave me. He takes two or three every seven, eight hours, 12 hours. We'll see how he does. I'm headed to the bay to join the looters. What I forgot to tell you was, we have a road trip looter, a, a fellow named Michael Chesser. He's from uh, St. Augustine, Florida. He got here yesterday. He's uh, staying over by the big rocks on the bay, so he's not far from where the guys are. But they've gathered up, I'm sure, together by now, because they were going to sort of meet each other in the middle. So I'm going to go in the middle and meet them all. See if they're holding any yellow, like Doc Beaver was yesterday. It's hard to fade that action, I can tell you. But we'll see how it goes. Be there in five minutes. Stand by. It's a shade before one. Low tide is at two, so I'll still be okay since we're on the bay. That'll be great. See you later. Well, I'm on top of Kilimanjaro looking down. That might be Michael right there. He says he's got a SE Pro. I don't know who that is. Though. That may be somebody new. I see, uh, looks like Low Tide Tim down that way. I can tell by his shirt. We'll see who this guy is. I don't see no other looters. I thought it would be plenty. Stand by. That's a, a GT, I think. He'd be picking me up in a minute. He'll say, damn, what's that noise? <laughs> I figured he'd be picking me up in a minute with all that noise. Oh, uh oh. How you been doing? Howdy. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes, okay. Sir. He's okay, got a severe sprain, I think, in his, in his ankle. I don't know. Well, I saw him hobbling around on your video. Yeah, last night. I just took long to, well, I had a walk in, so I had to wait a while longer than I thought I to get him into the doctor's office. Boy, it has been bleak so far. Yeah? Oh my God. Yeah, that's Tim down there, it looks like. Who's that? That looks like low tide Tim yeah, there. Yeah, it is. Uh, yeah, nothing. Every kind of metal there is except the right kind. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a lot of aluminum. Yeah, there's plenty of stuff to dig here. Yeah, well that's good though. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is good well, you sorted the doorknob, and the second target I dug was a dime. Well, not now. I got another dime, I think. Might be a quarter. It rings up between 43 and 46. I'm hoping a quarter. But here, you never know what it's going to be. There's so much odd stuff here on the bay. And deep. 1245 strong out of this hole. It's a 10 cent piece. An old green one. Well, I can knock it off, you can see it's clad. Okay, off we go. Well, there might have been two targets in that same hole, or another one right next to it, because I got another dime right here. But I don't know if it's in the hole or under the sand. Yeah, it must be, on t must be a new hole here. I, I mean a new target. But it's right next to the other one, you know. Eighteen forty-seven. That better be a quarter. Come out of there. A 
Because I think that's where the doorknob was too. We got it on the fifth scoop. Twenty twelve forty six. I see it's green. I don't know what it is. A nice green quarter. That's the old Tiquita. Now I can already see the class shining through. Ha! I hate it. Stand by. Now two feet away we got a 1914, which I'm sure is probably going to be a nickel. 714. I don't know why everything's got to be so deep here. Ha! That's three scoops. We got it from the third scoop of. I sure would like to see some yellow today. I ain't seen no yellow in a long time. Well, we got it. I see a green nickel shining through the rocks. Five meter cent. All right, off we go. Wait a minute. Now we got a 1030, right between the nickel and the dime. A 1030, what the hell could that be? Now it's reading 0430. I wouldn't be surprised, that ain't a bottle cap. Well, we got it on the second scoop. I don't see much in there. Oh, yeah, it's a penny. A cruddy penny at that. Man, some targets right here. I think that's all from a pocket spill last year. We'll spin around this little spot a little bit more. See if there's any more taquitos hiding. Nope. On we go. Michael said Denny is going this way and uh, John Beaver is already down this way. Stand by. We're headed to the east. I got 14 scoops out of this one, and it sounds great. I'm getting tired of it. I just dug one just like it right over behind you. 14 scoops. Stick your, stick your detector in there and tell me what it sounds like. I'm give up on it. 44, 45. I need 11, 41. 41. Well, that's okay. 42. Yeah. I couldn't get it out either. I got 15 or 16 scoops off of that one. Still 11 inches down. That's what I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> I ain't going to dig that no more. The hell with it. It's kind of broken up too. Yeah, I know it. Scratchy. 1210. Stand by, let's see what it is. Part of it sounds good, part of it sounds bad. Let's go to uh All metal it comes in a little better. Let's see. I'm hunting in high trash today. 
Then he's hunting in ground coin. Now this has got two signals. It's a, it's a lit. It's a grom. I mean, a, a what do you call it? A iron signal and a good signal. Now, if I was in the land of Nada, I'd think it was a bottle cap. But here, it could be any damn thing. Gray matter, piece of rusty anything. I don't think we got it, but we're just going to check and see. Just rocks. I don't hear it too good though. Let's take one more pipe out of there. If we don't find any more signal, we'll, we'll go on home. I mean, uh, go to the next spin to the east of here a little bit. Nothing. Must have been a false alarm. Or it fell through. Yep, there it is. It's a solid 1214 now. Could be another target. We got it on the second scoop. Piece of copper wire. Okay. Well, hello, Ty Tim. Sprained ankle. Sprained ankle, huh? How's the gold looking? This is about the bleakest day I've had this year. Yeah? yeah There's I plenty dug, of stuff here. I dug five or six bottomless pits. I got two. I got one right here I've been working on since you started talking to uh, Michael. Shit. I dug one down there. had 15 scoops. I quit on it. That, that's, I've, done, I've done several of those. 10, 12, 14 scoops. I said, fuck this. How's Beaver? Uh, he was, he was okay, but he, uh, I think he left. He, went, uh, he said he was going to the cave. Oh. He didn't anything here. So he parked over at the, uh, at the parking lot, at the uh, hotel parking lot. Oh. Beaver did, well, he's yawned it. Yeah. See, I, I parked right, I parked right in front of y'all. Did you? I don't, he's parked at 15th Bay. Yeah. I walked down to the, to the all the way down to the bed. All I got was the best note I got was this little thing right here, and I'm not sure what it is. It's one of those things that, you, that goes on the house on the eaves or something. Yeah. It's co pretty cool. It's um, brass or copper. Oh, yeah. Dual hinge off a boat. Is that what it is? Yeah. That's pretty it's cool. It's a nautical hinge. Is that what it is? That's mm -hmm. really cool. I like it. Made a hell of a nice sound. I got a dual hinge off a boat, too. I got the handle part, the knob. Yeah. First target I dug. All right. I'll check with you in a little while. All right. I'm going to go see what's going on with the. Uh, Here we got a nice strong 10, 28, 10, 30. 10, 28, 10, 30. Fourteen, twenty, fourteen, twenty-nine. 20, 29, I don't think it knows what it is. But it's a good solid sound. Finally we got it. A damn cruddy penny. Come out of there, you tiquito. Look at that thing. Ah.
Wind has actually dropped out a little bit. Everybody's gone. I'm just here in this hole knocking along. I got a fair amount of gray matter. I got a lot of dimes, a couple quarters, one or two nickels, a fair amount of pennies. See you in a little while. Thirteen ten, thirteen oh eight is the best of it. Ah, I see it's a fishing rig. I felt the string pull on it then. You see it? I think the sinker's hanging on the outside of it. Oh no, this, there ain't no sinker. Just the fishing rig. With no hook. Just a plain rig. And no good luck. Roundup from the bay. Gray matter. A few quarters. Seven, eight dimes. Wheat, I mean a glad penny with a hole in it. See you tomorrow. Don't know where yet. Stand by.